We begin tonight with the crime that has stranded a Vietnam veteran who is disabled. Good evening to you. I'm Carolyn Clifford and I'm Brian Abel. He counted on a modified golf cart for mobility, but someone stole it right out of the driveway. Seven Action News reporter Rudy Harper is in Oxford tonight where the family hopes the thief will just bring it back. The Vietnam vet has a hard time getting around. That golf cart was designed and modified specifically for him and it could hook to his trash can. It made the journey on trash days down the driveway a breeze. The family here says it was stolen Thursday night. This just comes in handy. This Christmas will be different at Gerald Lovely's home. Real handy. Many know him by his nickname Fuzz. This customized golf cart allowed the 75-year-old Vietnam vet who's disabled freedom to roam his 10 acres and so much more. Running down, getting the mail. Running down, taking the garbage down to the road. And I got hills up in my backyard, the mold of plowed up this high and running over with the golf cart, smashed the hills down. He's had multiple different types of cancer, uh, going through some lung cancer stuff right now. His son Jamie says it was a retirement gift and he spent countless hours on the modifications from personalized embroidered seats to a specially made gear shift to make it easier for him to drive. You put all that time into it and energy and my sons helped me work on it here and there and then Poof, it's gone. Jamie says the golf cart broke down Thursday in his parents' driveway and overnight it was stolen. He also says his parents have called this rural community home for more than three decades. Nobody, nobody steals that golf cart it meant a lot to the whole family because it was nice to still see, you know, pops getting out of the house and being able to get out and, and do a couple things. Sad because it just, it's not right for someone to take it. Fuzz's grandchildren are at a loss for words. It was fun when our cousins came over and like we got to ride on it. Oh yes, I would love to have it back. The family does not want to press charges. They just want the golf cart back. In Oxford, I'm Rudy Harper, 7 Action News. Yeah, and let's hope someone brings it back. Yep.